Hi, this is Walter of WalterMenton.com and I would just like to show you a couple of little things here. Uh, first of all, I'd appreciate it if you'd come on over to WalterMenton.com and have a look around. It's kind of a big about kind of a project of mine here. Anyway, this this picture here is if you can see the whole thing here, well this thing is so small. Anyway, this this picture is of my son when he was ten years old. And let's move it up, you can't really see the whole thing. Huh? <laughs> okay. Anyway, th this photograph was made with a Nikon film camera. Uh, that was before digital, you know. Anyway, um, the uh, the uh, baseball was way out of sight, traveling really fast, too high in the in the light, and all that kind of stuff. And that happens a lot when you take these kind of pictures, action pictures. And a simple improvement for that was I went on the internet, found a baseball, brought it over into Photoshop here. Uh, reduced its size and and cropped out the uh, the white background like here and put it right here in the picture and it, you know it, it, it uh, just to me it improves the picture some people you know don't care about things like that but I kind of like it uh, when things are illustrated much better a real baseball coming down like this would be blurred you wouldn't even be able to see it. But still, I like it. Now, if you want to make it blurred, you can. If you'd like to give it a little blur, uh, you would have to um, see, let me show you. See, it's on this level right here. You can move it around anywhere you want to. And if you select a level, we move that out of the way. Let's see, go to filter. Uh, let's see here. Do, 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 do. Distort. Uh, wait a minute. I gotta find it. Can never remember where things are. Uh, uh, let's see here. Uh, blur. Right there. I went right past it. Motion blur. Now you can blur it. Let me bring this over here. And you see, there's a little wheel, and you can kind of blur it in that direction, so that it's kind of aimed at the uh, kind of line of sight. You know, you can see it. Now, if the baseball was this close and he's looking like that, it's probably going to bonk him right on the head. <laughs> But anyway, you can, you're not really trying for absolute reality here. Also, you can do this. And you can do it like that. Let me cancel that. Undo motion blur. blur. Uh, let's see here. Select all. Edit. Copy. Okay, edit, paste, now I've got two, this one and this one, okay, now that I'll take the one, let's see, let me go down here, I'll take the one below, or no, excuse me, let me take the one on top, okay, select the one on top, so you've got two of them now, all I did was just copy and paste it. And uh, go to filter, blur, motion blur, and uh, I don't know, you don't have to have it so strong, just like that or whatever. I don't know. And, oh brother. moving around and then you can just move it up here like so 
See that is on top. And if you wanted to play around with this, like so, you'd probably have to play around with it. It's like it is right now, a little bit um, doesn't quite look right. Let's see. Let me see here. One of the things you can do with it over here is, you know, to make it look a little more realistic, kind of reduce the opacity. And then on the other layer, you could do the same thing. It doesn't have to be quite so strong. There. You know, something like that, you know. And, and you could play around with it, maybe get the direction Maybe get the direction here a little bit better by selecting it and turning. There, you know, something like that, and then and then perhaps moving it down a little more. So anyway, yeah, little things like that you can fill around with to. Uh, improved pictures and then of course the uh, uh, this uh, transparency had a little dust marks and you can use the uh, use the touch up tool the uh, I should say the clone tool the alternate key and hit the clone tool and, and you can kind of go in and, and touch up the uh, with it right next time I'll make another video on that okay well anyway thank you very much for watching come to WalterMenton.com. thank you bye see, see you in the next video